Hey y'all, it's your girl here, Candy Faces MUA, and today, ah, uh, ah, uh, today, I am bringing you all this look using the Warrior 3 by Juvia's. Ooh, ooh. I hope that you all enjoy. I'm feeling peacockish with this look. That's why I named this look Feeling Peacockish, okay? So this is my peacock expired makeup look. I hope that you all enjoy. If you haven't already, please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Also, if you hit that bell below, you'll be notified each and every time I upload. And I do appreciate all the love and support you guys have been showing me so far. And so, if you'd like to see how I achieved this look. Oh, y'all, yeah, this is my hair. Yes, ma'am. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. Yes, sir. <laughs> I am such a fool, y'all, but I am really feeling this look. Period. Okay, guys, I'll be back soon. Please, I hope you all enjoy the video. Give me a big thumbs up. Big thumbs up. Period. Oh, it's a look. It's a look. Well, it's about to be a look. <laughs> I went on and did one eye off oh, camera. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so let me tell y'all what I used. Um, I primed my lids. Well, I concealed my lids using the Maybelline New Instant Age Rewind Eraser of the Dark Circles. Um, I have not put this under my eye yet, but I did put it here. And then I set it with my Rimmel London Stay Matte Powder. Okay, and then for this look today, I used the Juvia's Warrior 3 palette. And then I also used... Um, these two glitters as well as some dramatic lashes from the k-doll collection i will leave her link down below if y'all want to purchase some of these dramatic lashes honey dramatic okay y'all so let's get into this look um when i went into this palette i grabbed this yellow shade first first Taking this green Looking like a can of Sprite. Sprite. Can Bella say Sprite? <laughs> but when I got to this portion, I just blended it in. Look at that. Just keep blending and blending. And it's looking like Sprite, like lemon lime up there. Okay, the next thing I did, I cut the lid. Lay Girl Pro Concealer in. Fun. I still have some on my hand from when I did the other eye and I cut it like so. Okay, and then once I did that, I just let it dry, guys. Let it dry. Taking this pink shade called Fanty, I put this on top of the lid.
Next, I took this shade here called Kahini. And I just placed it in between that pink and that green shade. I just touched it up lightly in this area here. Next, I used my Too Faced Glitter Glue. And I put this on the lid so we can put the glitter on. <laughs> so I'm putting some on the back of my hand here. And this is the brush that I use for the green glitter. So I'm just gonna put it in that area. I have this brush here. This is the one that I use to add the pink glitter. I'm gonna take some of that Too Faced glitter glue on this brush, put it here. Okay, one thing that I did do that I totally forgot, I did do the eyeliner first before I added the glitter, but that's okay. We're just going to have to try to make it do what it do, fix it as best as we can. I'm using this Wet n Wild Mega Liner. I started by drawing me a little wing here. Okay, not too bad, not too shabby at all. I think big ego, such a huge ego, loves big egos too much. The big ego mascara from Tarte. This big dramatic lash is from the K Doll collection. Let's get into it. I'm going to use this trio from Ulta Beauty. It has the lavender makeup setting spray, the lavender facial oil, as well as the poreless face primer, mineral oil free, paraben free, smooth and refines pores. So let's do that. I'm going to open up this primer and get the primer in his face, honey. You can drink some. How about that? Okay. I'll do whatever you say. I will just drink some. Okay. It's oh, that feels good. Let's put some on the lips too. Oh, goodness, that feels good. Get my hair up here. Okay, y'all, change of plans. I cannot get this open. And I got primer all on my hands, but it don't matter, it's all. But I will use it, just not today. I'm gonna use this Shea Stick from Juvia's in Mozambique.
Oh, y'all, this looks to be popping. I can already tell. Let me get rid of this light. Oh, that's way better. <laughs> yeah, popping. Ring light is kind of bright. Um, I'm going to take this Maybelline New Instant Age Rewind. Let's try this. Let's try something different. Under the eyes. See how this does today. I'm gonna take my Sonia Kashuk sponge as well as my In Beauty Power Up Set Mist. I don't have no water over here, so I just use that. Okay. So I got to tell y'all what happened to me today. This is don't off subject me. of makeup, but I got employee of the year, y'all. I got employee of the year at my job and I'm just so happy. So happy. I thought I'd share that with y'all. Okay, so I'm gonna take this Juvia's Shade Stick in Katsina. It's a little dark. I love to contour with this. Just a smidge like that. Well, I'm about that one. One of my two. Bam. Bam. Honestly, I'm not gonna do the forehead too much because I usually have my hair there. Okay. Sasha Buttercup setting powder. I'm gonna take this beauty blender and Blend, blend this Katsina into the skin. Into the skin. You know why? Because skin is in. That's why. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, I got employee of the year. I cried. I, I still can't believe it. That's wonderful. It's Happy Friday, y'all. It is Happy Friday. Okay. Happy Friday. I'm going to take this Anastasia in Beverly Hills and Espresso to set. And then I'm going to set the rest of my face with this I Am Magic Setting Powder in Gobi. Using this shade Kahina. Again, I'm going to use this for blush. Oh, that's pretty. And it's pigmented. Hmm, that's cute. That is pretty. <laughs> I am a mess. Okay, what we gonna do next? Uh, let me give me some shadow base for under my eyes. Let me take a brush so we ain't gotta touch it. Okay, we'll show one. Going into this beautiful palette, I'm gonna take this blue shade down here called Gola. Let's see what Gola a do. Yes, period. Okay, I'm gonna also use this purple shade in the center called Candice with the same brush. I'm gonna go under this part here.
Oh y'all, I love the way that this is looking. And as a matter of fact, I know what I'm gonna call this look. The Peacock Colorful Makeup Look. Okay, I'm taking this Anastasia Beverly Hill palette again because I need to chisel up my face a bit or at least chisel my nose. Cause I got to chisel up my nose a bit. You know, chisel. Chisel up my nose a bit. You know, chisel. <laughs> I'm a hot mess. Hot mess express. That's okay because it's on period anyway. Period, period, period. Gonna take this limp pencil from J Cat Beauty in the shade Beastry. I'm gonna do my lips on the neutral side since we have a peacock going on upstairs. We're gonna get all neutral and naked downstairs, okay? I'm gonna use the Too Faced Melted Matte metallic lipstick gloss i'm gonna use this cover girl smooches sizzle gloss in the shade 535 just to add a little gloss and glitter to my lips Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. I'm going to go into my Ulta Trio and grab this uh, lavender setting spray. If I can get up in this bag. You know what I'm saying? And get up in this bag. Get up in this bag. Okay. Let's see if it smells like lavender. Oh, it does. It does. Okay, y'all, this look is complete, honey. It's complete. I'm, I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling the look. I'm feeling the palette. I'm feeling the peacock, okay? Because I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling my, I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling my, let me take my hair down on y'all so y'all can, uh, Look at this lint, honey. Look at the lint. You know what I'm saying? We peacocking. We peacocking, okay? Who her is this? Who real her is this? It's mine. I said, who real her is this? It's all mine. Ooh. Yes, honey. Yes, because, oh, it's a look. It's a look. It's a look, look, look. Period. 